Me and my wife have been praying for promotion at my job. Last year, pastor told me that he saw my promotion and it is coming and that we have to keep on praying, trusting God. Well, I received my promotion. A very good one. By the way, and without going into much details, one of the most remarkable things is the Lord allowed me to be there to have every Sunday off to glorify Him. God bless you. I was living for a while in Holland and I was paying something. 2012, I decided to move back to Curacao to come and live here. I sent them an email to tell them that when I get a job here, I will continue my payments. They agree. I also asked them. I also asked them if they could um, clear the debt. And they did not agree on that. 2014, I got a job. I sent them an email and I told them I got a job and I will keep on paying. And I requested them again to get a um, debt cancellation. They said no. Um, two weeks ago, it was an email I was using in Holland. I, I do not check it anymore when I'm here. Once in a while I check it. Two weeks ago, I opened up my email. I saw that since last month they sent me a letter telling me that they will agree for the debt cancellation. Keep on praying and praise God. Amen. 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 God always cancels them. Yeah, I'm sure. 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 Yeah, I'm to obedience to the functional. Obedience to the work, to the uh, voice of um, obedience and I post the news. Those in Mampasar, two weeks ago, Joe yesterday, the, um, um, Thursday during prayer meeting, see, it have a, um, a I was kneeling power. down here before service ended. To Matera, Apostle Lisa, I heard the pastor say, I received all, I received two calls, I received two calls to the impact. He was saying that to God. At that moment, God told me, Saka um, Turbo take out all your money, paper money, all your paper money, to the money, and then empty your pocket. Empty, um, I say, go, what money is she? See, two cents, but in the other. Two, um, every money you have in your, in your purse. I want me to do what more, those what more in my tasks. I have two um, um, wallets in my bag. I have two 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 wallets in my bag. For I have received my best. If I gave your best, do not bomb you. For I received the best for the best. For so many, I reserve a million for a million. So I obey. Bye bye. I 
When? Sa katuloy pang pera. I took out all the paper money. Then, pati yan lang. No, sa usa. Masa katuloy. All the ones I do not use, I took them all out. Mano na, pastor. I gave them to pastor. Kasi yung great joy. I have. Mita din grand gozo. So, I buy free visa. I, went, I left the church. I went to pick up my son and my daughter. I um, go to school. When they left school, they came in the car. I, I felt in my heart go to the um, 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 bank, go to the cash automat and get the money. See, Mangusa. By Mangusa. When I got there, I saw my daughter in a stress situation. She was searching, searching. She said, Mom, I, 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 I forgot my glasses. I said, My God. It was an expensive um, um, glasses. I said, Lord, I just obeyed you. How can this happen? I, I, I drove very fast. My daughter said, Calm down, calm down. Lord, she forgot the glasses on the bench. We got out, we could not see her glasses. There was a lady there, we looked at her and said she was the one who stole the room. She came in, her glasses fell on the ground. How? I don't know. I was in such a shock because my daughter, she likes to forget stuff. Which means if I did not obey God, um, and take out all the money that I initially didn't want to take out and give to pastor I would have picked up my daughter go home and maybe 2017 would have realized that she lost her glass and I was in shock because it's a small thing it was a, a small thing and I was in shock. My app apostle. I am apostle. He didn't because of your obedience. He said because of your obedience. God rebuked the divider. God um Dios a reprende e devorador. On your behalf. Papa Kosa. Amen. Amen. That was right. Because it was the week the day I was going to uh, New York. Friday I was supposed to leave. And I would already change the money I was supposed to go. But I have some few guilders. I think about 300 guilders in my pocket. And then when I came in here, what I want to show you is God knows how to meet my needs. I kept that money in my pocket, but I want to get to the airport. I like to take coffee just sit down. When I said to him, Lord said to me, give it out. I took all the money in my pockets. I gave it out to people here. And before I left, God spoke to her. Do empty your pockets. But this is my money. But she has no money. And then God rebuked me. And God spent much money for that glass. Paga basta sempre para ele nem. God knows us. E Deus conhece nós. Obedecer. Amém. Amém. Next time you want to give testimony, you let me know because you didn't tell me before. Vou promover porque não tenho testemunho. Eu não recebi por ti. Bueno, quando eu cheguei aqui, eu não tinha nada. 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 I went to the doctor twice. I had a diarrhea that I didn't know where it came from. And for four weeks. And it made me very weak because I was um, only water was coming out. There was nothing else in my bowels because I was not eating. As soon as I eat something, it will 
leave my body. And I started to become very weak. And I received very uh, a lot of medicine. In the night hours when I was very weak, I was feeling as if I was leaving my body. And I am pastor and I told him. I told him via messenger that I know that pastor is a, he is an apostle, is a praying apostle, and he doesn't sleep. Like many times he says, and it was about one, um, it was about one thirty. I was very sick, and I was, I was feel like I was, I was feeling like I was dying. Uh -huh. I was typing and I said, Pastor, I'm very sick and I'm feeling like I'm dying. Please pray for me. And I said, I went to pray. I went to pray. When I couldn't anymore, I slept on. I didn't even look for his answer. I slept on. I was so tired. The next morning, I saw that apostle answered me. And he said, you will not die. You will live. And by the stripes of Jesus, you, you are healed. And I answered him and I told him I will come on Thursday. I received so much and truly I thought I was dying. I, I told the doctor that I had cancer and the doctor said I do not think I have cancer. <laughs> And the, the moment I felt ground, I, I believe that the Lord was working on me while I was on the ground. And in a supernatural way, I felt, I felt Jesus all in white. He was hugging me. He was hugging me. And he gave me a kiss on my forehead. <laughs> you know, she, when she sent the message to me, and she was saying, I should take care of the daughter that she was dying. I said, no. I said, no. I said, no. This is serious. <laughs> Bless you, sir. You have testimony? What is the testimony? Oh, Pastor removed the stick from me. Okay. <laughs> and I'm walking, I'm doing everything. I told your wife I was missing you. And she told me you were um, abroad. And I told her I received two songs for the church. And and they were things that oh I wanted to sing these songs with you. I fell down one time and I broke my hip. And I came to Pastor and asked him to pray for me. And God came through for me. I was walking with a stick. And, and Pastor took the stick and threw it away. And I said, I will come and give my testimony. And here I am. This is the song that God gave to me. Oh, mi Dios, you don't know. 
Dios y perdonanos tú nos junta a Él. is walking not to that stick again. If God, if you are sick here, don't give up. No Amen. Remember that very day. She will stand up by itself. Amen. But today is sit and stand by yourself. That is God. Amen. Amen. Bless you. Our God is a healer. Tell your name, our God is a healer. And only He take the glory. And all the honor goes to Him. Amen.